Let, why don't we talk about you know what is normal? Because right. people are, are probably like on the edge of this. He's okay, normal. Am I yeah. normal? Yeah. And so, so pornography not normal. So you know studies have been done all around the world where middle-aged doctors uh, wave rulers menacingly at patients and try to measure their penis size. Ooh. And uh, in, in spite of uh, how awful that might sound, we actually do have some numbers on what normal is. Great. And the average size, remember this is average, that means some are a little bigger, some are a little smaller, and even smaller than this is in that normal range, but the average size is just a little over five inches. That's it for the erect penis. When I say that's it, I mean that's it. That's what it is. It's good. It's how, good. How a little is that over measured, measured Dr. Spitz? Yeah. I would have to say that this gives me great relief. <laughs> that I am, in fact, ah. within the normal range. That's great. But how, and, and can I ask how that's measured? So this Since is measured every man by, out there is grabbing a ruler. Right. So it's very hard to get a man to have an erection on demand mm -hmm. uh, in a clinical setting. So it turns out that if you pull the penis and stretch it taut and measure from the base of the penis on the top side looking down to the tip, that stretched length is pretty much identical to what the length will be when it is erect. And so oh. a stretched length or an erect length of a little over five inches is normal. Now the soft or flaccid length will vary greatly. And when a guy is looking at his own goods and then looking at somebody else's, a lot of times there's some fat in the way. There's a little bulge that's hanging down and mm -hmm. obscure, it's obscured view, right? Mm -hmm. Partially obscured view, completely obscured view, depending on you know, how much of a man slide you've experienced. <laughs> and the, the, the thing is, is that the penis is anchored to the pubic bone, mm -hmm. but gravity pulls our skin and our fat ever downward, mm. but the penis isn't going anywhere, so it gets enshrouded. We can gain or lose weight, but our hands and feet stay the same size. So does our penis. And if we have a normal sized penis, it's no use fretting and obsessing over trying to change something that isn't going to change and doesn't need to change. So we, we have to go, but this is important. There is such a thing as micro penis. You mentioned less than 2% of the population. Yes. When should a man worry? I mean, obviously, if, if you're unable to no. conceive or, but, no. but when, is there a when, size when at which? your erect penis is under four inches, mm -hmm. then you fall into that range. But you know what? The vast majority of men who have a penis below normal have satisfying sex lives. Yeah. It's very few that come in seeking treatment. The vast majority sense. are seeking treatment because they are concerned about what is in fact a normal sized penis. I'm, I will say I'm 11 yeah. inches, 11 and so 5 8 inches. I, I, want, I want 3 8 more inches. I want to get to a foot. It's crazy. No woman wants that. I'm sorry. Yeah. And I will say this, that there are studies that say 85% of women are totally happy with their men's sizes. So you know what? It's all good, people.